click subscribe to receive notifications from the latest videos. Thank you. Heart of Dallas Bowl 2017, West Virginia vs. Utah Livestream, Live Score Updates The 2017 Zaxby's Heart of Dallas Bowl takes place Tuesday, December 26, at Cotton Bowl Stadium in Dallas, West Virginia, 7-5, meets Utah, 6-6, in this year's game. ESPN will televise the game live beginning at 12.30 p.m. Central. 1.30 p.m. Eastern. Utah is a 6.5 point favorite, according to Vegas Insider. The Mountaineers and Utes have not met since 1964, when Utah won 32-6 in the Liberty Bowl. Preview if the heart of Dallas Bowl comes down to a kick for Utah against West Virginia, the Utes will turn to someone who entered this season with only one year of high school football didn't know what the Lugrosa award was, yet walked off with it a few weeks ago. Matt Gay has difficulty describing what has transpired over the past five months. It's been crazy, he said. I'm trying to figure out the emotion of things. If you're looking for a Heart of Dallas Bowl live stream, you can find it at Watch ESPN. Gay's Utes, 6-6, Need a victory Tuesday to finish with a winning record for the fourth consecutive season. West Virginia, 7-5, already has done that but wants to end a two-game losing streak that began when quarterback Will Grier, eighth in the FBS in passing yards per game, was lost with a broken middle finger on his passing hand during the first quarter against Texas. Gay walked on last summer after playing soccer for Utah Valley and narrowly lost the starting job to freshman Shaden Johnston. After Johnston's first attempt went wide from 45 yards in Utah's opener, Gay was told, you have the next one. And the job was his. Gay leads the FBS with 27 field goals, missing only four attempts. He has hit eight of at least 50 yards converting twice from 56. Gay was awarded a scholarship in October, days after he was reclassified athletically as a junior through a ruling related to taking a Mormon mission while at Utah Valley. I'd like to say I coached him up, Utes coach Kyle Whittingham said. He conceded that Gay arrived with excellent mechanics while working with a private coach and Utah's staff gave him a few tips here and there. His approach on the ball is fast, Mountaineers coach Dana Holgorsen said. I don't know what his range is. It's longer than 56. Three Mountaineers receivers, including second-team All-America David Sills v. rank in the top 30 in receiving yardage. Sophomore Christian Ganov took over for Grier and went 24 of 46 for 326 yards. It's not like he doesn't know the offense. Hole Gorson said. Things to consider in the second meeting between the schools, the first a 32-6 Utah victory 53 years ago. Thank you for watching this video. If you find this video interesting please like and share to many friends know. Do you have any questions please comment below to let everyone know. And do not forget to click on the subscribe button to receive notifications from the latest videos. Goodbye and see you again.